really haven't changed one bit, have you? Wow. Tobias. Hey Nick, the house. It's yours. Finally, after so long. Thanks, man. <laughs> Thank you, Tobias. <laughs> it's been years. Decades at least, since I've been inside this house. I lived here when I was just a kid, with my family. My mom, my siblings, my, uh, my dad. I received a call from Tobias telling me that they were finally ready with the repairs this morning. Took them long enough. <laughs> it's funny. Even after what happened, and all that time away from home, it looks just like I remembered it to be. Is my memory that precise? Uh, of course, things like the furniture and photos aren't here anymore, but hey, can't blame anybody for that. <laughs> right, right. I guess I better use that memory for something useful. I don't have the full story, nor do I know why it happened, but I can tell you how it started. Everything else is up to you to figure out. This is the story of the night I lost my home, my childhood, and almost my family. When Five Nights at Freddy's just ended. The joy of creation story mode, boys. It's happening. Hello everyone, hope you're all having an amazing day today, and today we are playing the joy of creation story mode. I know I've done this on a live stream a long time ago, but I just wanted to get back into this, and I don't know, I just felt like playing it again, so I hope you don't mind. <laughs> also, apparently Nixon, the creator of this game, announced that he's finally working on the Ignited Collection, because like he didn't have time to work on it before because he works for Glowstick Entertainment, which makes the game Dark Deception, which I'm pretty sure you're familiar with. So yeah, he's been pretty busy, and... Now that he's finally working on the Ignited Collection, might as well play this to get us all hyped for it, you know? Oh yeah, we got the bedroom right here. Let's go. In we go. Yes, yes, he's okay. Don't worry, he just seems uh, confused. Uh, ex excuse me, sir, can you tell me your name? Oh, look, man, if you won't talk, I'm calling the police. You can't just barge into someone's house like this. Are you hurt? Do you need any help? Honey, what's going on? I don't know. This man suddenly just appears in our house. He takes on some of the cases, but I don't know. He's dead here. Michael! about to go down. I don't think you should be here. Uh, yeah, I was just saying that. You, uh, well, you, you look a little bit roughed up. What happened to you? I, I, I don't know. I, I can't remember. Uh, but I'm sorry, but, but I just, I, I just don't know. After that, Dad carried the stranger to our guest room. 
He thanked me for convincing my parents to let him rest in our house for a night. Or at least, while he collected his thoughts. After that, Mom put me in bed. I can't remember much about Michael, but I knew he wasn't a bad person. Or, at least he didn't look, you know, dangerous. I was young, so I guess I just didn't know any better. Certainly didn't know what a burglar was, that's for sure. Um, not that I was implying he was, I'd never talk to him again after that. Well, except for when the storm happened. That's when I woke up on my bed, and I saw them. Oh, ho, ho, ho. And this is when it begins, boys. Hello? Hello, hello, uh, Nick? Uh, hey, little Nicky, it's me, Michael. And hey, you don't hello? Back. Hello, hello? Monsters around that'll hear you if you do. Now, don't be scared, Nick, okay? Listen to Yay. me. Yay! You can defeat those monsters. Sorry, okay. I'll shut up. Okay, so these monsters might look, uh... First things first, uh, Freddy, uh, the fuzzy brown bear. Uh, he's at the window, Nick. Uh, he'll peek inside. Close your curtains and keep them closed until you hear him leave, or else he'll get inside. Uh, then there's Bonnie, the uh, ill-tempered big purple bunny. Uh, keep an eye on your door. He'll be there. Uh, he's not shy at all. Uh, he will knock on the door to let you know he's there. But once he opens the door, shut off the lights as fast as you can, Nick. He can't see you well in the dark. Uh, oh, but make sure you're sitting down when you do that, all right? Okay, uh, then there's the chicken. Um, that was a little bit weird. Um, check the closets often. Uh, if she's peeking through, make sure to disable the lights. Uh, she doesn't want to be seen. <laughs> Ignoring her doesn't help either. If she does catch you with the lights on, she'll scare you and stun you. Now, look, I, I know this is a lot to take in, little Nikki, okay? Just, just listen carefully and try to remember it. Okay. Alright, last is Foxy. Uh, he'll be right beneath your bed, Nick. You'll hear scraping from the bottom of the crib when he's there. Uh, be watchful if you see his hook on the back of your bed, because soon enough he'll be right there next to the bed. Uh, don't look directly at him, Nick. Instead, pretend to sleep. Alright, just pretend to sleep. Yeah, just lie down without moving too much. Look up and close your eyes. Uh, Foxy sees eyes as if they're big bright spotlights okay so if you pretend to sleep he won't know you're there anymore but don't open them until you know he's gone okay okay uh so to recap um freddy is at the window so if you see him he can close the curtains until he's gone uh bonnie will knock on the door and open it afterwards uh disable the lights and sit down until he leaves Chica will try to stun you by scaring you, so if you see her peeking through the closet, shut off your lights and don't pretend to sleep. She'll think you're gone. And Foxy will appear under your crib and move upwards, so when he's next to your bed, pretend to sleep until you hear him leave. All right, you got all that? All right, good. Uh, listen, I have to go, little buddy, okay? Just hang in there. Or they'll leave at 6 a.m., I'm sure of it. You can do this, okay? And so it begins. Oh, wow. Now all I gotta do is just wait for these suckers to show up. So... That's fun. Freddy? Are you gonna come in? I could really use the company right now. Okay, guess not. <laughs> if you guys are enjoying the video so far, feel free to leave a, a like and comment. Because believe me, your comments are the greatest thing ever to me. And then there goes Freddy. Alright, cool. So we already had our first visitor. Me wondering where Bonnie is at the moment, because he'll probably not... There he is. <laughs> okay, I wasn't expecting him to actually show up. Okay, 
<laughs> All right. Not even 1 a.m. Hey, Freddy. Smacking your face on my window. Oh, that is such a cool animation. Okay, that was the second knock. Okay, so by the third knock is when we need to sit down. I guess I'm just going to sit here and wait. And everything's just dead silent now, like as if everyone was just scared of me. Ah, they should be scared because I'm the one. They're trapped. Like, wait, that doesn't make any sense. I'm sorry. What I meant to say is that they're the ones who are trapped in here with me. <laughs> there, does that sound better? Come on, Bonnie. Holy crap. Hi, Chica. Everyone just suddenly showed up. Alright, you're... We're all safe against Chica. We don't need to sit down at all. We just need to turn off the lights for Chica and Bonnie. And me wondering where the heck Foxy is. If Foxy shows up now, that might be perfect. But no, he's probably going to wait until Freddy comes in so they can tag team and try to kill me. Oh, man. Such atmospheric. Such an atmospheric game. I love it. Alright, there's Chica again. What's up, Chica? You're terrifying. Okay. You gonna leave? Goodbye. Shoo. Thank you. Need to keep my light on at all co- Uh, Freddy, you keep interrupting me. That's so rude. Alright, just bring it on, Freddy. Foxy's probably gonna show up any second now. Yep, there it is. Come on, Freddy. Come on, leave. Yes. Alright, and we sleep. There. And that is how you get rid of Foxy. Just pretend to sleep and he'll just slide right back under the bed. Like, like, what's he doing under my bed anyway? He's just vibing of some sort? Chica, you are so aggressive tonight for some reason, and that makes me question what you're really doing in my closet. Get out. Get out of my closet. Thank you. Okay, Bonnie, you wanna... bring your second knock? Or third knock, I should say. Sorry, I'm just... Oh, no. Don't you dare come at this moment in time, Bonnie. I swear. Come on, come on. Leave, Bonnie, please. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, that is a close one. See, they'll try to, like, end up, like, combining all into one to attack you all at the same time. But, don't worry, they can actually wait a few seconds before they'll start attacking you. Okay, Foxy gonna show up at my crib now? Okay, we're doing pretty good. It's already 3 a.m., we're, we're doing great, we're having a good time. We just vibing with these fellow animatronics. And boop the snoot. Alrighty. Freddy, you gonna come in again? Or Foxy? Which oh, it's Foxy, okay. Okay, that was just Bonnie's first knock, alright. Oh no. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Crap. Yep, yeah, there. Okay, I'm I'm just dead. Okay, it's all because Chica and Foxy just combine themselves and Foxy will never be able to kill you unless you look at him. That's nice. That is very nice. All right, let's try this crap again. Uh, 
Fun times, fun times. Alright, turn this on. Alright, hello, Freddy. How are you, buddy? You, you're coming in to say hi, I know. But no. <laughs> Get out of my house! <laughs> it's just like new neighbors when you move into a neighborhood. Just freaking... <laughs> hello, is anyone in there? <laughs> One's in the closet, one's outside your window, one's outside your bedroom door, one's hiding under your bed. That's like literally the perfect way to describe new neighbors, am I right, fellas? <laughs> well, the idea of it just sounds so goofy to me. Okay. Alright. Freddy's back. Bonnie's back. Foxy scraping under the crib. Get rid of Freddy. Nice. And then there's Chica, who won't freaking leave me alone. Go away, Chica. You suck. Thank you. <laughs> I showed her. <laughs> Sorry, that was very mean of me. Okay, Bonnie's going to come in by his next knock. It's, it's still 3 a.m. Ah, oh, crap. Come on, Freddy, show up now. Show up now, please, Freddy, please. Uh. Come on. Okay, I can sleep now, Foxy. I'm going to sleep. <laughs> I cannot believe I survived that. Okay. Thank goodness. Oh my goodness. I'm hearing stuff. My heartbeat's getting faster. I'm losing my mind. For good luck. Ha. No one's in here, Bonnie. Oh my goodness. Th all three of them. Okay, okay, okay. Come on. Good. Uh, it's still for it. Oh, crap. This is not good. This is totally not good. Shush, man. Are they gonna get you if you can, if you're screaming right at them? Come on, 5 a.m. Please, come on, please, 5 a.m. Come on, come on, come on, Freddy. Oh, for a second there. Oh crap. Oh, thank goodness. Ah, screw you, Chica. You thought you could catch me. Everything's becoming nutty. It's getting worse. I think I might die. But no. I won't. I refuse to. I will survive. Sup, Freddy? brown beard boy yeah I showed you <laughs> get out I'm getting dressed Chica you suck come on okay looks like Foxy's coming to say hello Okay, now pretend to sleep. Okay, go away, Bonnie, please. Please, go away. I'm losing my sanity here. Oh, there's Freddy. I couldn't even hear him over the sound of my own heartbeat. 6 a.m., come on. <gasps> yes! Let's go, we did it. 
I have no idea how I survived that, but I did. Holy crap. <laughs> oh, that is. Da -da -da. Da -da -da -da. Yeah, two new years of Five Nights at Freddy's Creator commemorates the occasion by releasing brand new behind the scenes screenshots. Yay! <laughs> Alright, boys, that'll be it for today. Hope you enjoyed part one of the Joy of Creation story mode revisited. And if you did enjoy, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you're new. Don't forget to turn on notifications. And I hope to see you all in the next one. Bye!